Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. If you are new, welcome. My name is Hannah and on this channel we talk all things home decor, home aesthetics, mixing high and low with new and old. And in today's video, it is best of home goods for the month of March. So if this is something you are interested in watching, just keep on watching. If you are new to my channel, welcome. I head to home goods every single month to showcase the best products that I can find. Textiles, home decor, furniture, you name it, I compile into one video every single month here on my YouTube channel. Now there are two pieces of information that I'm gonna provide with every single item showcased in today's video. One of that being the style number and two being the department number. Now that information is important because that is what you need to see if your local home goods has that item in stock. Just give them a call, give them kind of a brief description of what you're looking for and those numbers and hopefully they'll be able to put it aside for you. But obviously every location varies with product so hopefully these videos come as a guide to see what is trending for the month, what is out there on the shelves and hopefully you guys enjoy. And the second portion of today's video, I'm gonna give you guys a little miniature haul of the items that I picked up. I did pick up about five items from this month's Home Goods run, so hopefully you guys will stick around to see what I grabbed. But without further ado, you guys, let's get into Home Goods Best of for the month of March. This next side table is a dupe for the RH Baby and Child Kenzie Small Side Table in Brass. RH's version retails for $440, whereas this one was only priced at $59.99. This next handled vase is a dupe for the Tuscan handcrafted terracotta vase from Pottery Barn. Here at Home Goods, this one was only priced at $49.99 and would make a killer statement on any console table. If you have been wanting to add some luxe items to your home, Home Goods has a variety of marble and natural stone decor pieces and different elements, including this really fun trinket box as well as this beautiful serving tray. Put some crackers on here or cheese and this would make the perfect addition for hosting a party. This next find was a beautiful six drawer dresser with fluted detailing and brass hardware. This was by the company Tahari Home priced at $600. HomeGoods has had such a great selection of big furniture pieces. So before spending money on something from Amazon, be sure to check out HomeGoods because they've had so many great finds recently in store.
This next lamp by Ralph Lauren was priced at $200 and this is such a classic style and shape for a lamp. If you have been on the hunt for something that exudes that just classic feel, these are a really great option and they also came in a variety of different base colors. These next set of genuine leather accent chairs are a dupe for the Crate and Barrel Barrett chair that is priced at $2,200 online. These were priced at $600 a piece, but the leather was absolutely stunning and these would make a great addition to any seating area. This beautiful black arched sideboard reminded me a lot of the Our House Hattie sideboard that is priced at $2,600. This one here at Home Goods was only priced at $500. And one thing I really loved about this cabinet is that it did have a lighter interior, so that way, core in there, it would really make a huge statement. These next set of scalloped velvet mob swivel chairs were absolutely beautiful, priced at $400 a piece. I thought they were very fun for the right space. If you have a moody or very feminine area to add accent chairs to, they would make a really beautiful addition. This next candle I picked up and found out that this one is actually from World Market. First time I've ever seen anything from World Market sold at Home Goods, but if you like their candles, they're now sold at Home Goods. These next set of leopard wine glasses are a dupe for the West Elm Mari drinking glass. For a set of four, it is priced at $48. Here at Home Goods, these ones are priced at $4.99, so you're definitely getting that dupe for less. I know I spoke about home goods stems last video, but I had to retouch on it. These stems from Martha Stewart are a snowball price at $20 and they are so beautiful. Great selection for quite a few stems there. Now there are two brands to be on the lookout for in your next trips to home goods, Allstate and Martha Stewart. These two brands have stood out to me as the most realistic stems at home goods and such a great buy. All right, welcome to part two of my home goods best of where I give you guys kind of a small little haul of the items that I picked up. Now, I usually do pretty well. Typically don't buy a lot. You guys would be surprised as much as I do these videos and I'm at the locations, honestly, what feels like a weekly basis, but I only got four new items here that I'm excited to show you guys, so let's get into it. Starting with the first item, which you guys will recognize, I picked up this really beautiful bundle of garden roses. I love that they are closed. The coloring is absolutely beautiful. These look incredibly realistic. I was very surprised to find these at Home Goods, and they were priced at $15. And you get a total of two, four, six stems. 
You could leave them paired like this or you could separate them and put them into another arrangement, but I thought the color was really pretty, very muted for spring and summertime, and they're just very realistic. I was very pleased with these. So this was the first item that I snagged. The second item I picked up was a candle. Now, when I look at candles, the first thing that I notice are their vessels, the container that they are poured in. That is like the first thing that I gravitate towards, and then the scent obviously comes second. But I feel packaging is really important when it comes to your candles because your candle, no matter where you place it in your home, is just as much a part of that style as any other decor item. So I pay really close attention to packaging and detail. When I came across this candle, I thought it was absolutely, absolutely beautiful. This is what it looks like. It's just got this really beautiful fluted detailing. You've got just like the detail of the cap and the exterior. It's so pretty. So the overall weight is almost 20 ounces of candle. This guy was priced at $12.99. And the scent is Blooming Mandarin. So it's definitely a Voluspa dupe. If you guys are familiar with like Voluspa's main kind of scent, their signature scent, that is exactly what this smells like. But I thought this packaging was so beautiful coming into the spring and summertime and just would make such a great addition to any style. So that was the second item I picked up from Home Goods. All right, item number three, I found on TJ Maxx a few weeks ago, and then I was pleasantly surprised to find them in store at Home Goods. I picked up these really beautiful leopard wine glasses. Now, these are the dupe for the West Elm ones, which a set of four is priced at almost $50, whereas I paid $4.99 a glass. And when I tell you guys, these, you can tell the quality. They are so well made. They are very heavy to the touch. Sometimes when I look at glasses, like they're very delicate, like you would almost feel like you'd break them if you were too rough with them, not with these. And I think these are gonna be stunning. I picked up four of these and really excited to use these for summertime. So that was the third item I picked up. All right, the very last item in today's home goods haul. I did not showcase this item in this video because I found it after I had done all of my filming. But I'm telling you guys, when I came across this item, I literally squealed just a little bit. Are you guys ready for this? So beautiful. So I found this incredibly beautiful, all natural scalloped dish, bowl, boat, whatever you want to call it, trough. You guys can see how big it is. The coloring is absolutely beautiful. It's got a mixture of different warmer tones in there. Good, nice veining through there. This guy was priced at $49.99 but this is something you could find at CP2 for probably $200, if not more. This is a natural stone. It says it was made in Pakistan, that's the sticker on it, but just, I mean, so pretty. And bowls are just so universal. I mean, this thing could be moved all around my house and still get so much use out of it, but be on the hunt for this guy. This is definitely a steal of a deal. Love this. So this was the last item I picked up from Home Goods. All right, you guys, and that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed Home Goods Best of for the month of March. As always, make sure to tune into next month where we talk about April and hopefully find some really good finds as we come into spring and summer. But until the next time, I love you guys so much. Thank you for being here, and we'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.